and welcome to the family entertainment edition of Who Wants to Be a Millionaire? I'm sure you're keen to get into that hot seat, so let's get started. Okay, let's take a quick check on the rules. Up to four of you can play the game and each of you will need to choose adult or junior questions. Then for the first time ever, you'll be able to choose the type of questions you'd like to answer. There are three categories, general knowledge, entertainment, and sport. Simply choose one and stick with it. All you need to do then is answer the 15 questions that stand between you and a virtual one million pounds. As always, you can walk away at any time and there are the usual three lifelines available to you. Ask the audience, 50-50, and phone a friend. If you make it all the way to a million, you could be jetting off on a luxurious family holiday by entering our competition. So grab your remote control and let's play. Who wants to be a millionaire? Select the difficulty and category of questions you'd like to play. Great, you're having a go at the entertainment questions. 15 of them stand between you and a virtual million pounds. The first five of those questions can bank you a guaranteed thousand pounds. Have a look at question one. Well done, that's a great start. A nice easy question for £200. Very good, that's right. Now you've not used any lifelines, so they are still all available if you need them on this £300 question. Well done, you've won £300. Question number four is for 500 quid. Uh, you wouldn't want to give me a wrong answer at this stage, would you? And it's a good job you didn't. You've got the right answer. This is the last chance that you could leave us with absolutely nothing. Please don't do that. Here comes question number five. You had 500 pounds. You now have 1,000 pounds. It's the right answer. That's what I like to see. Five correct answers and 1,000 pounds safely in the bank. This is where things hot up a little bit, though, as we try and turn that £1,000 into at least 32000 Here comes question number six. Now, remember, you still have all three lifelines remaining. Right, here we go then, audience. Best of luck, everybody. We need your help to get this question right. Just choose one of the four available answers on your keypad. If you're all ready, please all vote now. Well, it looks like B is the popular choice of the audience. You asked for their advice. Are you now going to use it? Very well played. That's the right answer for £2,000. Okay, a chance to double that £2,000 to £4,000 now with question number seven. The very best of luck. Here it comes. Well, I don't blame you for using a lifeline if you're not sure. Pick one of your friends and we'll give them a call. Oh no, I wish you'd ask someone else this one. I've got a feeling it might be B. I always like to have a guess, so I'll go with that. I think your friend suggested B there, but I'm not sure they were overly confident. It's up to you at the end of the day. 
You'll lose a thousand pounds if you get this wrong. Are you sure you want to play this? You had two thousand pounds. I can tell you, it was the right answer. You doubled your money to four thousand. OK, let's have a look at the situation. You have given me seven correct answers, and you are now just seven more correct answers away from me asking you a question for a virtual one million pounds. You have only one lifeline left to help you, but it's not impossible, and it'd be really nice if you could at least get to the next big milestone. First things first, let's get you up to eight thousand pounds. Lots of luck. Are you sure you want to play this question? Very well done. That's the right answer, and it's worth eight thousand pounds. Okay, things are getting a little bit more serious now. Sixteen thousand pounds is a lot of money, and that's how much you can win by giving me the right answer to question number nine. The drop, if you get this wrong, though, has gone up to seven thousand. So think carefully before you give me an answer. You had eight thousand pounds. You decided to play this question, and you'll be glad you did. It's the right answer. You just won sixteen thousand pounds. Right, this is a very serious moment. You have sixteen thousand pounds. If you do get the next question right, you'll definitely be leaving with no less than thirty-two thousand pounds. Give me a wrong answer though, and you have to take a drop of fifteen thousand. Not good. I really do wish you the very best of luck. Here comes question number ten. Okay, you want to use your fifty-fifty lifeline computer. Can you take away two wrong answers for us, please? Has the 50-50 helped you win £32,000? It certainly has. Well played. You can breathe a sigh of relief now. You will not be leaving with anything less than £32,000. And you might as well play the next question, as you now have nothing to lose. Get this right. And I'll be giving you sixty-four thousand. Have a look. Here it comes. I really hope this is the right answer. I can tell you, it is the right answer. You've just won sixty-four thousand pounds. Right, the prize increases really kick in now. The next question is worth one hundred and twenty-five thousand pounds, and believe it or not, you are only four correct answers away from winning one million. You will lose thirty-two thousand if you give me a wrong answer, and you've used up all three of your lifelines. Right. Let's not waste any time. I have to tell you that you gave me the right answer. Fantastically well played. You just won one hundred and twenty-five thousand pounds. You could be about to lose ninety-three thousand pounds if you give me the wrong answer to this question. If you give me a correct answer, you'll win a quarter of a million pounds. Now, I would much rather that happened. The very best of luck to you. Let's have a look at question number thirteen of a possible fifteen. You could be about to become a quarter of a millionaire, or of course, you could be about to lose ninety-three thousand pounds. You've just given me the right answer. Terrific! You could now go all the way.
Wow, this is a superb performance. I've just written you out a virtual check for £250,000. Now, hopefully, you can go further. I'm about to ask you a question worth half a million pounds. 500,000. Remember, you have used up all your lifelines, so it would be a serious risk to just guess at this stage, as you would lose £218,000. Have a look at the question. It's number 14 of a possible 15. Right, this is a very big moment in the game. Are you confident that's the answer you want to go for? You just risked 218,000 pounds. You had a quarter of a million. You now have half a million. Amazing, you are one of our biggest ever winners. Right, here we go then. This is your one and perhaps only ever chance to win one million pounds. You have no lifelines left, so you are either going to have to make a complete guess or, of course, you may well just know the answer. I should remind you of the massive amount of money you could lose, but think of what you could win. The best of luck, everybody here is rooting for you. Sing Sweet Nightingale is a song from which classic Disney film? Pinocchio, Cinderella, Dumbo, Bambi. And I have to check that you are really going to play this question. Is this your final answer? Amazingly, you have decided to play the million pound question. Now, you could have walked away with half a million pounds, but instead you are walking away with one million pounds. You're a winner, fantastically well done. Not only have you won a million, you've also got the chance to enter a draw to win a fantastic, all expenses paid family holiday. Just text the winning code to the number on your screen. Very well done, and thanks for playing the family entertainment edition of Who Wants to Be a Millionaire?